Hello everybody, it's me again. I'm gonna show you the easiest project ever of the Internet of Things. And now I just connected this CC3200 board to my USB uh, cable and the USB cable to my computer. And I just opened my Wi-Fi settings over here and I just choose my simple link uh, in, a, in uh, just like an address or just like a final number in order to and know that is a different board from the others and then I came back to it and I opened this 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 was browser and I just typed down my simple my simple link dot net and it appears this it it opens this this web page like this is some information about the system what it includes about everything a uh, small overview of the same thing and some links that points to a different resources and also this is about uh, the uh, the mm, the settings also of the of the board this is the setup of the same board if you want to connect it to the to your your router uh, to to connect this thing to the internet actually after that, you have this uh, information about the st the architecture of the of the board and also what tools do you have you, you have uh, uh, available in order to develop like something. But this is this is the the the, the, the part that I would like to show you. You have this home automation that basically what I when I push this button I just turn make this LED blink uh, show it now basically it's like what it does it doesn't got co coordinated with the with the image but the 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 LED starts blinking at that time and I can stop it just here this is amazing this is everything is wireless this USB cable does it have anything just is just powering this this is stuff over here and also I have these appliances <clears throat> basically what we have here is the this this sensor that is here and if I touch it it changes the temperature and it's pretty it's, it's really cold over here and the dryer is a stop that is the same what that that what it say but if I start moving this thing the accelerometer um, detects like a threshold or something and it says like now that is running and if I stop it stop doing that it says that the dryers are stopping so uh, more information about it the next one is about security so you don't have your alarm here you don't have your alarm like activated so you can you can also move it's activated with the with the accelerometer you can move it and nothing happens then you turn it on and when somebody opens the door bam the alarm it's activated right let me see I think there is some bug over there uh, here we go here we have now and the last one is the smart energy basically what you have here is when this temperature is below the temperature that is um, retrieved by your your thermometer and uh, this LED is blinking but when you increase this temperature like beyond that threshold 69 it start it, it stops blinking and it just turn it on turn it that on so basically what the, it it's demonstrating here that you can use this application in order to to control like thermostat before and after you reach the threshold you can do uh, this kind of thing so this is this is the first demo that i have been testing today and this is pretty amazing it's pretty simple this is out of the box i didn't need it even to set up anything I have it on the, the back over here, <laughs> but hope you like it.